Anyway, let me wrap up. I only have two minutes left. Um, so what can we do to improve uh, trust? Because that's why I'm here, uh, to share some insight about that. And the great thing about trust is it's actually uh, controlled by a hormone. It's a physical thing. And I think, I'm sure you all know oxytocin, the hormone that controls trust. So the higher level of oxytocin, the more trusting we are, and the lower level, the less trusting we are. Now, could you just take a pill? Uh, yes, and generally you could. However, the problem is that we don't have a pill that is long lasting. You can actually take medication that will work only for a few minutes where you actually start to be more social and engaging and trusting and also better at creating trust. So that's not really a method that would work in a negotiation because in a negotiation you want to develop and build trust. So imagine this being in a negotiation. We also know, and I'm not kidding, that sex will generate oxytocin as well. But technically that is not allowed when you're negotiating with somebody else. So. <laughs> I would not recommend that, it looks weird and it could be illegal in a lot of places, right? So that's not a way to go either. Uh, childbirth is something that will increase oxytocin as well for women, obviously, but I wouldn't encourage that medically and to do that in a negotiation. So what is left? Well, what you actually got left down here is laughter. That is increasing oxytocin and food, by the way, guys. So sharing a meal, having fun at a negotiation is something that is really cool. I did, um, I'm the um, uh, expert negotiator for World Commerce and Contracting, and we do a webinar um, several times a year with them. And we had a great guy, a British guy, who an expert in humor, ex-actor uh, uh, as well, you can Google that one. And I would watch that as a whole hour where we just talk about humor in negotiation, or should humor be in negotiation? And his question was, why shouldn't it? I mean, you absolutely need humor in negotiation.